So this uh, discussion showed up on my dash on Tumblr um, that was started by this comic that was saying, you know, was, you know, against girls who are against bronies, if you follow, um, saying, basically berating girls who like guy things yet berate guys for liking, for being a brony. And I'll put, I'll put the link in the description so you can check that out so you can better understand what I'm talking about. And then this long discussion and all this other crap. Now, about, you know, the fake geek girl crap and, you know, brony culture and all this other stuff. And, okay. And, like, like a guy was saying, he's like, well, I'm not allowed, when I was a kid, I wasn't allowed to like the girly stuff. And, you know, I was just reclaiming it. it. Like saying, you know, guys can like girly stuff too. But the thing is, is that brony culture has taken away from that. And it's gotten into, like, weird shit. And I'm not saying... I'm saying brony culture, please notice that. That's meaning the majority or the general representation or depiction or blah 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 blah. I'm not talking about every single fucking brony here. Yeah, it can, yeah, it's been kind of weird. And there have been so many instances of fucking, you know, um, women who are fans of the show being, you know, it's like, no, you can't like it kind of thing by bronies, or even, like, they am intruding on children's areas and whatever else, and, like, with sexual crap, which is not, what the fuck, dude. Um, I'm not saying liking a girl show is wrong. Like girl shows. Go a fucking head. Girls like guy stuff, but the thing is, is that, uh, where guys are just, like, treated like, okay, you're a little weird, Girls are fucking berated and insulted and having to answer a million and one questions to show that they have to be super hardcore fans to wear a fucking Batman t-shirt. They have to justify their fandom all the time. Whereas bronies, they, they're accepted that they're just really into the show, but kind of made fun of a little bit. Whereas girls, they have the, the whole fake geek girl thing is fucking bullshit. Because it has this idea that, oh wait, no, girl couldn't possibly like this guy thing. Whereas, if a guy likes a girl thing, nobody fucking questions it. They, at most, they kind of say, it's like, what? You like... Thing is, is that they're getting made fun of because they like it. Not being questioned... Not being told that they don't like it as much as they claim to. Or whatever else, like with the um, fake geek girls. Which... Let me just say something. Fake geek girls is such a fucking stupid term because... You're a geek? If you're passionate about something, you're a girl if you're a, if you say you're a girl. So, how can you be a fake geek girl if you like something and you're a girl? Are you like a ghost or are you imaginary or something? Like, it's so stupid. And this whole discussion of like guy stuff versus girl stuff is so fucking stupid. Fiction is meant to be enjoyed. It's meant to be indulged and consumed. It's not meant to spark discussions of who can and can and can't enjoy it. Like, the idea that certain types of fiction can only be enjoyed by certain types of people is fucking retarded. And anyone who doesn't fit the target demographic is berated with all this crap. Like, I'm a girl. I fucking love Deadpool and Spider-Man. I have tons of comics and I know more about superheroes than any other guy I've met. I have t-shirts and I w if you get me talking about something then I will fucking rant and ra uh, rant about it. But uh and I don't like a, t a lot of what is typically girl stuff, but I oh, fucking hell. Anyways, but I still do like a few things. I'm trying to think of something but I can't. <laughs> um but and that's cool, whatever. If a guy wants to like and watch girl stuff, go ahead. Who cares? Oh, yeah, like, I, like I, sorry, I like all that stuff, but I also like Monster High. Like, make fun of me for that all you want. I don't care. It's a cool sh thing. Anyways. Um, so, like, honestly, why should it matter who you are if you like something? All that sh should ma all it like, gender? In sh or age or whatever else should not be required for interest in something. All that should be required is interest in something. Like, ta-da! And I like, I mean, I'm an adult and I love kids' shows because 
fucking kid shows are better than a lot of adult shows because they always adults follow the all these same stupid tropes and kid shows tend to be more creative and have more you know I don't know not in depth characters but they more uh, variety of personality types almost and um, all this other stuff and you know you got more crazy and fantastical things happening in kids shows plus I just love animation on that note Another kind of um, segregation within fans is uh, anime fans. Now, I watch anime. I I don't know if I would call myself an anime fan, but there's some anime shows that I watch. I more watch it because there's, hey, these cool shows, and hey, I like watching animation less than, oh my god, I love anime and culture and all, and all this other stuff. It just, it's, yeah, anyways. Um, I like it for the stories and characters more often than not, and the fact that I like watching animated stuff because I'm an artist and stuff like that. Anyways, so, but I personally cannot stand the subs. I prefer to watch it in dubbed. And, and if anyone's not, um, if it, eh, anyone's unfamiliar with that kind of lingo, subs mean it has a Japanese audio um with english subtitles dubs means that they've dubbed english audio um like uh voice actors um over the animation so that you know you're listening it to it in english instead of listening to a japanese and reading in english i personally cannot stand to be trying to watch the show and read at the same time meanwhile there's all this distracting language and i do that i don't understand a word of going on at the same time i i prefer to just be able to relax and just kind of because the thing is too is that my eyes wander all the fucking time and i have adhd so it makes it hard for me to try to focus and because uh, because i like watch whenever i'm watching animation i'm watching the style i'm not just watching what's going on i'm also watching like all this other stuff anyways that's my reasoning for liking it and there's so many anime fans who are like no you can't enjoy it properly unless you uh watch the subs all oh, the dubs are only tr uh, f you know true fans watch the subs and you you don't actually like anime unless you're watching the subs and i get so much shit for watching anime in an available format i get the same characters i get the same show i get the same story it's just i consume it slightly differently that'd be like getting mad at someone for reading a book in braille when they're instead of reading it uh text on a page it's just a different means of consuming the same media because some people don't like like the, the reason why there are different formats available is that different types of people can enjoy it and this whole so that's just like a non-gendered example of fan segregation um and saying like only certain people blah 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 it's so stupid here's the thing someone's interest in something should be applauded not condemned and berated and all this other crap because being passionate about something is a beautiful thing it shows life within you being having interest and in noticing things and it's just it's a beautiful thing to know like be passionate or interested in something why do we have to and whenever i find out someone else likes the same thing as me i get excited i don't care if they don't they're not as into it as me is i can talk to someone about my fandom because i'm just like exploding with all this interest in it and i can just explode it and have fun and have it build upon and it's just finding a friend you know who likes the same thing as you it's awesome so why is it there are fans who get mad at other fans because they're not who they think should be enjoying the media or they're not enjoying it the same way human beings are div diverse beings and we're like so different from one another it, why does it not make sense for some people that we be different in our means of consumption of media and our fandoms and all that other crap to me it makes more sense than not to be like that that's just my two cents thanks for listening